I have been obsessed with these. So I'm going back to this box to try another one of the shades. These are the Moira highlights. They are literally so stunning. They are gorgeous. <gasps> okay, I almost dropped all of them. Fear not, only one fell. I'm gonna try to show you, but maybe I should just like hold them up. Because I am so fair, I really do wanna try Dreamlight. It is the lightest shade that it's in here. I think it might be the lightest one that they have as well. These bronzy highlights look so gorgeous, and I kinda wanna either use them as like an eyeshadow and see if they work that way, or I will just give them to my friends. But literally, like the gold tone ones look so stunning. And then this foxy pink one also looks really great. If you wanna see any of the other shades, let me know. I've used two already, Honeysuckle and Ballerina. I am obsessed with both of them. I take Honeysuckle with me, I think, every single time I travel now. But I really want to try Dreamlight because I think it looks really cute. And if it's like a silvery bright, like bright, bright highlight, I'm excited. <gasps> cute. Oh, 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 yeah. That is stunning. Wow. But let's see how it wears. I think they're so, so quality. I had a high-end highlighter that was very expensive in very flimsy packaging. And for the amount of money that I spent for that product, I expected the packaging to be a little more hardy. These, these are literally $9.50. $9.50. Love to see it. Amazing. These have held up so well for me. The two that I've been using constantly so far, I'm absolutely obsessed with. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit on my cheeks. I don't really highlight my cheeks that often. When I do, I'm very particular about it. So I'm hoping that this is one of the ones that I can do that with. So far, again, with the other formulations and the other shades I've tried, it's gone really well. I like a more seamless kind of one on the cheeks. Sometimes I want glitter. Sometimes I want speckles of glitter you can see from outer space. Other times I want a translucent base and the fairy dust kind of highlight. Sometimes I want a glow from within, but let's just see how this one looks on the cheeks. I'm going to take just a little bit of it and run it right here really lightly. I know that I could probably build that up, but I want to keep it legitimately right there. That is how I would wear it on the cheeks. Maybe I'm just going to add like a little bit more though. Just like to see. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. It has that kind of seamless, you don't see it, you see it. I like that. I like that. So far, so good. A little bit over here. Yeah, that's really pretty. That is really pretty. I'm not surprised. I knew I would like this one. Really, that is stunning. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna highlight my brow bone and my nose pretty intensely because that is what I like. Just gonna put a little dot. Yep, and then I'm gonna pat it out. Yep, yep. Now I'm gonna take this on the brow bone and because I shave off half of my brow, I'm gonna take it a little bit in here. Ooh, -hoo, okay. And then a little bit under here. Not so much under like my fake tail, but like mostly right there to highlight my actual brow bone. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Here's the thing. I think this is a little bit more gold than I was anticipating. Like it kind of flashes a little more gold. I wish this one was a little more silver just for my preferences. Like, or at least I wish there was another shade that was like icy white silver kind of highlight. You know what I mean? Because let me show you. Oh yeah, that's soft. That feels nice. On my finger, you can see that there is a bit of gold like to it. And I think like in any swatch, you would be able to see that as well. Yeah, you see how there's like a goldness to it. Like it is lighter. It is a lighter highlight, but there is gold in it. You understand. I'm just gonna go over my cheeks really quickly with this. Go over the nose to blend it. I think it is very pretty. It is definitely one that I will continue to use. I just wish there was like a silver shade in this because I love this formula so much. This is Honeysuckle, which I think might be my favorite. I just keep returning to this one. This one is so soft and it has a little, it has that goldness to it, but it also has like the tiniest bit of pink to it as well. Uh, you really can't tell in that swatch and I put it in the worst place possible, but Ballerina is like pink, pink, like pink, pink foxy pink also looks interesting too but anyway let me know your thoughts on these thank you so much for watching follow me for more makeup and beauty content and i will catch you in the next video bye i'm glowing i'm healthy i'm hydrated